Hey everyone, this is Andrew Ty and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to install AutoCAD for Mac 2024 on the Apple Silicon Mac. So this is the version that is the latest one that's been released. And today I'm going to show you how to get the free trial for this to use it for 30 days. Or if you want to install it and then register with your current AutoCAD Autodesk account, then you can also do that as well. This application has been updated to the 2024 version, which is natively optimized for the Apple Silicon chip. So it's going to run faster and more efficiently than any previous version of AutoCAD. So today I'm going to show you how to install this software and also how to make use of the free trial as well and get you all started working on AutoCAD 2024. So if you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest tech tutorials. So the first thing I'm going to do is to go to the autodesk.com website, which I'll leave a link to in the description. What we're going to do is to scroll down on the right hand side here and go to this section here called free trials. So we're going to download the free trial in order to make sure that this works before we go ahead and purchase a license or enter your license details. So in this section here, which I'll also leave a link to as well, you'll get straight to the free trial section. What we're going to do is to scroll down and then we're going to find AutoCAD. So here we're going to press the download free trial button. Here I'm going to register this as business use, press next. Here we want to select AutoCAD for Mac and then press next. And then what we're going to do is to sign into our account. So because this is a fresh trial, I'm going to press create an account. And then I'm going to go ahead and enter my full details, including first name, last name, email, password. So just go ahead and do that and then press the create account button. So once the account's created, we're going to press the done button here. And once we're signed into our account, it's going to ask us for phone verification. So you need to enter a phone number of some kind, and then it's going to send you a verification code through your phone. And then we're going to enter the security code here. So now we need to fill out some details. We're just going to pretty much write anything we want. Then we need to write our company name. And now we've filled out all the details. We have the option here to download the Mac version 2024 in English. So we could also select different languages. We can have German, Spanish, French, Italian, Japanese, Korean, and Chinese. These are all options, but all we want to do is to press the download button here, and then it's going to download the autodesk.dmg and start our 30 day free trial. So once the download is complete, we're going to go to the finder application and then go to our downloads folder. And then we're going to find the Autodesk AutoCAD 2024 macOS.dmg. Just go ahead and double click on this. And this is going to open up this installer window. And then we have the option here to double click on install Autodesk AutoCAD 2024 for Mac. So go ahead and double click on this. Now it's saying that install Autodesk AutoCAD is an app downloaded from the internet. Are you sure you want to open it? Press the open button here. So here it's saying the installer would like to access the downloads folder. Press OK. So here we're going to enter our administrator password and then press OK. And now it's starting the install process. Just going to minimize this. Here it's saying preparing let it complete. So now we're going to go ahead and agree to the terms of use and then press next. So now we're going to install on our local hard drive. So I'm going to select Macintosh HD and then press the install button. And now it's continuing the process of installing AutoCAD 2024 for Mac. So now it's saying that the install is complete. We're going to press the start button. Here it's saying it's verifying AutoCAD 2024. So if we go to the dock, we can see that this has started bouncing up. And then here it's detected a previous release from AutoCAD 2023. We're going to press OK and it's going to pick up the previous settings. Here it's asking us to view the log file. We're going to press no. Here it's asking for permission to read the documents folder. Press OK. And now we can see AutoCAD for 2024 is working. Here I'm going to sign in with my Autodesk ID. Once you've verified your accounts by email, then press continue. And then we can minimize this. Press the restart sign in button. Then we're going to press go to product. And then it's asking us to open Autodesk Identity Manager. So go ahead and press open. And now it's saying opening product. And now the session has started with the local software. We have 30 days left to continue our trial. So go ahead and close this little window. Here it's asking us about privacy settings. Just press OK. So now we have AutoCAD for Mac 2024 open. So here we're going to open up a project. I'm going to open up ACAD 3D.dwt. Press open. I'm just going to show you that this is a working application. So here we can see that this project is open. I'm not really much of an expert on AutoCAD, so I'm not going to be able to show you anything. But as far as I can see, it's all working correctly. So you can see that this is product version U61M182 AutoCAD 2024 for Mac. So we can see here that AutoCAD is an Apple CPU type. This means that it's natively optimized for the Apple Silicon chip. So this should work faster than any previous versions of AutoCAD, which were Intel binaries. And this is all working correctly. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. I've got lots of other tutorial videos about Macs on my YouTube channel, so please check it out. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.